Okay, we're back with another mock draft. We're doing the simulator yeah. again, post combine. And last time we did this, you want to go check it out. People were like, you know, you suck. Basically, you guys aren't doing. What was that about? Yeah. Hey, it's not that easy. Okay, when people are yeah. coming off the board, anybody can do a mock draft. But at the simulator, they take people off. You can't just be in Candyland forever. So let's do this, Craig. And by the way, can I just say, if we were doing this the real way, we'd have 15 minutes for this first pick. Exactly. And then we'd have 10 minutes, 10 minutes. Five, and like we did four picks in like 13 minutes. Like, come on. Yeah. Come on. Well, come on. What, what, watch this on, though. Because we, we throw us a bone here. You know, you love it. And we're post combine. So there's no way this is going to be so good. We just know what's up now. So we're the lions. I put us three rounds. Here we go. Uh, for simplicity's sake, we're not going to do a trade, but in just real world life, real quick, any trade is what we want to do in the draft. If we get offered, yeah, I don't want to say anything, but I mean, we want to go back, but we're not okay, doing we're, trades. I'd do it. I, I would do a trade. If Are they going to offer us one? No, we're not going to try and trade with the Jags, though. That's for sure. No, no. You pick um who you want to trade with. Let's just roll it. Let's just roll it. Let's just it. roll it. Yep. They're going to take, okay. They're going to take Hutch. Pretty consistent. They're going to take Hutch. Okay. <sighs> so are you ready for this? So like I'm struggling because last time we very clearly wanted to take Kyle Hamilton here. I think we were in agreement on that. I am freaking out just a little bit about his combine. I know that it's not, everything. It's not a big deal, but I'm going through right now. And I have to go all the way to the bottom of safeties to find his 40 yard dash. I have all the times up right now. And he did. Okay. When nope. it comes to the combine, I mean, 4.59 40 yard dash. I understand he's six, four. I understand he's not a small person. He's 220 pounds. Uh, he's got D lineman out running him. The, <laughs> the, the three cone, the shuttle, he showed some stuff in, in his explosion, but well, I, if you're, unless you're just a stupid superior athlete, I don't want to draft you. So what are you thinking here? Are you thinking going, are you thinking going edge? Are you thinking Thibodeau yeah, still mean, after he skipped? Are you thinking? Of yeah, that's what you look at it. I mean, you got Kyle Hamilton and, and then if you don't do that, then you've got a corner. I'm not going to do that. We're not going to do all these do tackles, another corner. So I am, I feel, <laughs> I feel like Thibodeau is the guy now. And um, yeah. for me and that, I would be happy with that edge rusher. It's what we need. We, Flowers is gone. What it, it doesn't really matter anyway, but it's just like edge rusher Thibodeau. I'm actually good with that right now. Okay. Do it. All right. I love it. Ah, oh, I feel so good. Hamilton went right next, right after. See, it feels like, okay, there goes a Jabo Dean. We, we need a, 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 Primo oh, Olave. I was gonna say we need a we need a nice receiver to be here. Okay. Marm. Nope. Don't see him. <laughs> Don't okay. See. All right. So here's here's where I'm at with it. Um, we didn't take Hamilton at the number two spot, right? Yep. We didn't take Hamilton at the two spot. Um, we went with we went with a D end. I still think we need to go safety. Can you show me? Let's look in round one here because you have control of it. Yep. Is Dax Hill already off the board? I don't think he is. So I guess the question for me becomes oh, yeah, no, he's right here. Yeah, that's fine. Is between Lewis Seen oh, yeah. and Daxton Hill. Like that's where yeah. I'd want to go right now um, with what we have. Also, we're doing this mock. I think the Thibodeau one makes the most sense considering we released Trey Flowers today. Yep. So I think we doubled down and we go there. I have no problem with that pick either, but I think he'll still, he'll more likely be available at 34. Um, yeah, I'm with so, you. I like, so you, uh, you like Lewis sign. Cause he well, did, yeah, he, I like, I like him and Hill. They're both sub four, four guys. Like they absolutely destroyed Hamilton at the combine. And I understand that they might not have some of the playmaking, but I think they have an opportunity to be really, really good. Uh, Nick Cross might be available in the third round at safety. That would be a good pick too. Yep. Um, he showed some really good stuff at the combine, but both seen or sign, however you say it, and Dax Hill, they ran a three or a four, three, seven or four, three, eight. Like you can't, you can't scoff at that. We knew Dax Hill was going to put up good numbers, but uh, yeah, I, I, I'd be good with either one of those guys. And I'm, I, 
I'd be fine with Desmond Ritter. Oh, yes, I would be too, but I'm with you. I like, I like the safety here, a huge need on the defense. Mm -hmm. Why not just again, book it Dax Hill. Let's do it. Can I ask you a question? Would you rather draft Dax Hill and hope that he becomes something and re-sign Tracy Walker, or would you rather go after Marcus Williams and pay him big bucks in free agency? Uh, Dax Hill and Tracy Walker. Is that what I think you get two safeties for the price of one. Boom. So we took Dax Hill. I love it. They Jaguars now address tackle. So now we can go. Here's (laughs) where, here's where we're going to just, I mean, Brad Holmes, this is where you got to earn it, buddy. Cause it's going to be, do you go linebacker or receiver? We still have not gone receiver. Um, what, what do you do, Craig? Linebacker. We got a nice linebacker here. A couple nice linebackers. Or do you go receiver? Yeah. So, um, linebacker out of Wisconsin, that's not a bad pick. I was looking at, um, uh, the linebacker out of, uh, of Minnesota. Um, yes. and he, and, and, and he went, I think it was McShay mock drafted him to us in his post combine, um, okay. mock draft there. I, I still really, really like Christian Harris. Like I really like Christian Harris. Like that to me is the pick. There's just so many linebackers. Do you think one of these guys are going to fall the way to pick um, 66? Oh, I like Christian Harris too. I love fi- just fixing linebacker. I, that's the pick I would go to. And then just, I'm just be curious who then would I, be available wide receiver wise. I can't wait to see pick. it. So here's what I'm going to say. I think there's still going to be good wide receivers available at 66. I don't think there's, I think you're going to have a drop off tier at linebacker. And if um, one of those guys, we just talked, talked about one of those three guys or Muma are still available at 66. I can eat some crow. That's fine with me. Yep. Um, <laughs> but I, I love it. I love Christian Harris. I'm going to lock that in and dude and ran like he was a cornerback. <laughs> like I, I want to like see... I was <laughs> Oh. While you're going to the next one, I'm just going to pull it up. You know, yeah. he ran a four, four, four. <laughs> like, and, dude, that is, oh, uh, and that, what are we look doing? What and we, everybody's like Kyle Hamilton. Oh, he ran a four, six. That doesn't disqualify him. Yeah. But I just drafted a linebacker, a full round later that is faster. And I know speed isn't everything, but it's a lot. Yeah. It, it just is. And, and to take, Hamilton at two because we know he's not going to be there later it's just too much so yeah so let's see here what receivers will still be available because I think we have to take a receiver anticipation's killing me and you put it away you're not sharing (laughs) the screen right now so here we go Justin Ross Justin Ross and welcome to the Super Bowl boom I'm doing it there he's still there and I know there's some injury stuff and there's but like what is he like six four six three like yeah. He's the X receiver. He's the go up, win a, win a jump ball wide receiver. Like how great is that? And that's what we are. That's our dream. And that's what we're looking for is we've got those guys still there. And like you said, yes. that, that is just, he's what the lions have said they've wanted all, all along. And there he sits. So let's, let's see kind of what we're left with here is we'll have one more pick and here you can, <laughs> boy, there's Nick cross still. Is he still sitting there? Cause wow. Yeah. No, I mean, you look at kind of these top guys or you go quarterback here and take a flyer. Cause we, nope. okay. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Don't even want to Kelvin Austin. Um, that's an interesting. Yeah. That's, that is interesting to me. There's some, there's some upside there. Um, uh, again, tight end is another just need like, not not a need. What, what's left on tight end? Let's look at the tight ends a second. Okay. Let me look at tight end. I see. Let's look at um let's look at QB. Just oh, for you want to look at QB. giggles. There's, there's nothing left. Oh, there's there is boy. Okay. Okay. Oh, Jack Cohn. Nope. <laughs> yeah, that's right. All right, let's uh, all right, let me go back to. You can look available. for another wide receiver here. That's not the end of the world. Um, you could go for another linebacker. What do we got left at linebacker? Yeah, let's look at linebacker. Yeah, we are gonna apps. I have no problem doubling up on on uh, on things here. 
I like, I like, let me go back to it. Nick cross and now another safety or no, like, cause now. See, I like cross. I like cross at safety. I really do. I also really like Kelvin Austin um, yep. at receiver. I feel like he can give you special teams help. He can be out of the slot. He can be kind of a gadget player. Um, he ran a four, three, two. Um, okay. he, he's, he's fast. He's got a 40 inch <laughs> vertical, um, good shuttle time. Like, I mean, the dude, he's quick. I like um, it. The, the NFL comp is Isaiah McKenzie, um, which is kind of, if I watched the lines last year and I know you don't want to spend a third round pick on just a special teams guy, but when we watched the lions last year, I don't know about you, but it was a little painful watching special teams returns. Like yeah. you just never had the thought that it was, it was going to go and, and bust one big. Sometimes just having that pure speed in the special teams, it changes things and just having it on the field. So, yeah. And cause you know, we're going to get rid of Khalif Raymond. Um, I mean, I think we, we, we're just the really replacement. Bare. Yeah. We're still not, we're still bare. Even with Josh Reynolds, I don't want to say bare, but I mean, the wide receivers is a huge, we cannot, we've kind of gotten used to how like bad it was. And obviously St. Brown came on and then Reynolds, but I yeah. mean, Cephas, is he healthy? I don't know. So I'm good with, um, he is. I'm good with doubling up on this. Let's do I'm good uh, with this. And like, if you, what's the worst thing you have, another guy you can play in the slot and you have yeah. your new, you have a special teams weapon. Look at this. Welcome to the super bowl. When, well, Christian here. Okay. That stings. That stings a little. <laughs> they didn't like that pick. Why? <laughs> the one that we did. It's really simple. It's because on their big board, he's ranked 53 and we picked him at 34. Yep. And like, and that's, that's why, it. it. But I mean, tell us what you think in the comments. Like we, we just, uh, had some fun with this one, but we're, I mean, this is, I mean, that does not look too far off, Craig. I mean, that, that is a real scenario, Thibodeau Hill. And then again, man, that, that pick 32 and 34, it's like, well, not only that, but knowing Brad Holmes and knowing that he likes to wait on wide receiver and also PFF, why do you have Daxon Hill as a cornerback? Like he's a safety, but that's fine. You can write them there. I think the mock draft, if you want to make fun of us, that's fine. Right now, I think we need to make fun of PFF a little bit. We're like multiple <laughs> yeah. days out of the combine, and I don't see any change in their draft simulator from before the combine. Yeah. So come on. They gotta get they gotta get rolling with this. I think they have a really friendly draft simulator, but uh we gotta do it. Maybe next week we go to Pro Football Network's draft simulator and, that sounds and we good. Go, go with that. So yeah, no, I love it. Um let us know what you think in the comments, subscribe, and we'll get you um, our latest content that's coming out because this is it. This yep. is the off season, free agency, draft, training camp. It's all coming up. So we the will fun catch- season. It's the dream this, season. This is it. This is what we love. So we will see all of you on the next one. See you.